guys ladies and gentlemen this is literally the end of the world i'm i'm sorry i'm making so much videos recently it's just because top 11 is just dropping bombshell after bombshell after bombshell of news they have a new loading screen will look absolutely amazing they have some Nordius brand gloves everything it would be cool if they sell they sold those actually and gave those away like when we win certain and certain competition thing but there's a, so much to talk about top 11 could not wait until 2018 to drop this they have to drop it right right <laughs> No. Let's go into the first one. Let's use this as an example. And let's turn down the volume as much as we can. Because we don't want too much. Alright, so this ties into what I'm going to show you, but no, I'm not supporting any of you. Look how clean it looks now. Let's put this. Oh, we can't. Put it over here. I right, look how clean it look now. Everything just look finished. Ush. Yeah, everything on here look awesome. And I and I started off there because that's the place where at least I want to change, and I don't want to spoil too much for everybody so the squad i tried to avoid it so much so much reason being because i didn't want to go in there at first but there's a so much features in this and the first thing i'm going to start off is the lineup the lineup is more clean than ever i have everything set up nice and easy and it just look fantastic now let's go to the formation and I haven't used the tactic yet so I don't know if it would change in any way so the thing that I said when I started it was that the highlighted areas shows the place that they're gonna have more position in the place with least highlights will be the place that they're gonna least have position in so that is good in a way so for players who like to play three defenders and stuff like that four defenders it's gonna it's gonna reflect more of how it would be in a real match instead of ridiculously like if you have three defenders are still as good as four defenders at the back so that's a good thing the other good thing is for the formations that put a lot of players in the forward and a small amount of players in midfield and defense they're gonna get affected because they're gonna leave a lot of space in the middle and when they leave that space in the middle you're gonna have teams that are gonna that are well structured that are well balanced that are gonna beat them and that's another good thing so this update really focus on the realism of the game and it really brings us one more step closer to absolutely perfecting what happens in a real game and this position thing is something that I really like let's start about the least relevant the substitution and the reserves set beautifully absolutely amazing you can do everything that you can do from from the line of from here you can go on the players you can you, you can upgrade them everything this player is not gonna be here next season oh oh not yet I'm doing something alright so here it tells you that a good attack is built on us blah 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 you have a side menus which is the match day which set you I haven't really paid attention to this but this is three one let's put these here you have the two strikers here 
and I just realized this just now. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. People don't set up a formation like that. I'm just showing you something. This formation here, the one, the three, two, one, two, two formation. That's the formation of my opponent. So the way this is set up basically is showing you how your team will play against this team, which is my opponent. Here we are. Alright, so let's set it up right here. Well, one more thing I want to show you. We have this reverse button here, which brings the formation back to the last one that we previously set up. And it is saved automatically. I don't know the time limit is every 3 minutes or every 4 minutes, but it is saved automatically. And it's reversed back to your previous formation, the formation that I was using, 2, 5, 3. I can't believe they put a word to that, but it's there. But that is actually good. Next thing is my team. My team thus brings up the formation alone and nothing else. So you can customize it to where you want to bring the pairs and everything. Next one is set piece. Set piece is absolutely amazing. It gives you the formish, the, the 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 normal pairs, the substitution reserve, and you can pick who you want on your left corner and your right corner. Free kick over here, free kick over here, penalty, and the captain. That is a fantastic settings. And this game does this feature this new feature is five star in my book everything here is the same nothing changed over here so it's really gonna bring a whole new setup to how we set up our team against other teams so how we set up our teams in matches and it's a good thing and i don't think it's really a bad thing but it does mean that we have to move really be more focused and we have to upgrade our tactical skills in setting up matches and it will be no longer that this formation beat that formation all the time because it all depends on how you set up your formation so it is just awesome what do you guys think about this do you like it do you hate it is this good is this bad in my opinion i love it and it is good in my opinion. So thank you guys for watching. And I will see if I can make some more videos about this. And I will see you soon.